I saw over a dozen children out there last night, and more this morning at dawn. Who are they? What do they want? I lost souls. Little ones. Tied to the earth. They want to leave, but they can. They can only leave on the tears of those who love them. The tears. Those who are living. You're trying to tell me that those children are dead? They're souls. Spirits in transit. Miss Florence. I'm not a child. I don't believe in ghosts. Now, just, I want some answers. Just tell me, who, who, who's that girl in white, for example? What did she want? Of all the lost souls, she is the most lost. She has been waiting, waiting for too long, and she's turned. She's become bitter, jealous. But what does she want with me? Perhaps she's afraid. Afraid that you're going to take Nikki away. Nikki? My daughter? Nikki here? I can't believe that. You can't. Or you won't. My daughter's dead. That's all I know. She's not a ghost dressed in some Halloween outfit. Running around for a crazy old woman! And why have you come here? resolution pass we squeaked through it was a little hairy but shannon finance how do we stand nothing you can't handle by mortgaging your house i thought that might get your attention what the hell happened to you car got stuck why don't you just go home too much to do we found out something very interesting while you were away what's that the place does not collapse if you're gone a day or two no, it's just the rest of the world that's collapsing. Well, everything by itself doesn't seem like much, but at least not now, but at the time, you know, first the, the drawing and then the photograph and then Caitlin's dreams just all added up. I had to find a place. Why didn't you tell me? Should have I know that now? I was stupid. I wasn't stupid. It was for Nikki. You were remembering her. So, was it the same house Nikki drew? Yeah. Exactly. That's weird. I know. It's hard to believe. Well. Maybe she copied it from a picture. If it's a vintage antebellum house, it's probably in a lot of books. Yeah. Does anybody live there? A blind lady. Florence. She's the last of the family line, I guess. And there's some children there. They're just children playing in the ground. That's all. Must be the only people south of the Mason Dixon with a fire going tonight. Yeah, I felt a chill. I just thought, you know. It's all right. Makes me feel safe. Mark, you told me everything, right? I'm not losing it, Chris. Really, I'll be okay. I love you and Caitlin so much. I just. After I told you what Nikki said, oh, Mark, I know how much you loved her. I can't bring her back. No one's asking you to. I'm so sorry for what I said. I was upset. Shh.
the blue today? Because. 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 And why is the water so wet today? Because. 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 Why is mommy so pretty today? Because. 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 And why is daddy so silly today? Because. 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 Those barkers. Who me? No. Everything's under control. Honest. Hey, kiddo. What are you doing? Trolley. Can I see? Drawing an owl. I don't know. Starved, honey. When's dinner? Just a few minutes. Open the wine. What's that, pigeon? Shut the windows. What? Shut the windows. <laughs> It's an owl. An owl? What's wrong with an owl? Just stay inside. I want to see the owl. out here someplace. Get back in the house. I want to see it. I told you to stay inside. Whatever it was, it's gone now. Come back in. I'm going to go check on Kate. Caitlin's only seven years old. She doesn't understand death. If she can't understand, we'll never see Nikki again. You believe that? You sure? We have to be. I wish I could be so certain. But after tonight, I, I don't know. Mark, for God's sake. 
Mike, help me make some sense of this. When I went to Latimer Grove, when I met Miss Florence, I saw the same girl that Caitlin saw here tonight. But that wasn't a real girl. She was a nightmare. Then how do you explain Caitlin and I seeing the same girl? I don't know. How did she get here? There were a lot of children there. Miss Florence called them lost souls. She told me that Nikki was there. I, uh, I brought my family. Oh, oh, what for heaven's sake. I was just thinking about you all. How so? Well, I wanted to meet the ones who can help you more than I can. Well, this is my wife, Chris. Oh, you, Chris. How nice to meet you. Hello. And this is my daughter, Caitlin. Caitlin, this is Miss Latimer. Call me Florence, dear. Won't you come and sit a spell? Well, Caitlin, now let me guess how tall you are. You like guessing games? Yes, I do. Well, I bet you're as tall as the bird bird there. No. Well, I mean... With a big blue jay on it. Yes. <laughs> what about an owl? A big white owl. You saw her again? She came to our house. She tried to get Caitlin to join Nikki. How terrible for you. Yes, it was. And we have to stop it from happening again. Is that why you've come to see me? Yes. Is Nikki in your house? Well, I'm not sure, Caitlin. Let's go and see. something to hear? It sounds like birds. Is it the owl? No. It sounds like ducks or geese, maybe. Come here. This 
this was Daddy's favorite room. He loved the marshlands. He painted these tiles himself. suggesting things. We're giving her these ideas. She's not... <laughs> it's very difficult for us to accept all of these things that are happening. It's, it's beyond all reason. But there are more things in heaven and earth. Than a dream of. I, I want to protect Caitlin from all of this. But you can, not the way you want to. Everything we have, everything that's dear to us is on loan. And we should treasure it as if we could lose it tomorrow. That's the best you can give to Caitlin. No, oh, I don't know. And the best that you can do for Nikki is to let her go. exhausted. Admit it. Come on. We all need to get sleep. We've got an early start in the morning. I've got to go back there. What about us? What about your family? I'll go alone. You'll have the car and what am I supposed to do? I'll walk. Yes, midnight. The mansion's more than a mile away.
want to see Nikki. To daddy! Don't believe that girl! Caitlin! Caitlin! <gasps> Caitlin, is that you? Honey, are you all right? No. Position. I've done enough already. She'll be fine. Just got to get her home. Where's Mom? He's still out there searching for something. Of course, he's searching because he has to. Nikki knew you loved her. You've nothing to make up to her for. He loved her too. Really, he did. He just couldn't let go and show it. He had to be so strong. Oh, how strange a weakness for him to hide his love from his own child. Chris! 
Daddy? Where have you come from? I don't know. I just know, somehow, that you've been trying to find me. Yes, I have. For a long time. What do you want? I want you to stay. I want to turn that clock. I want to change everything that happened on that awful night. Clocks don't go backwards. trying everything to be a better father. I see now how so much of what I did was wrong. I want to say I'm sorry, but I can't forgive myself. I can. That night was only one night of my whole life. There were so many others. So many good ones. I remember I used to fall asleep in the car. And you carry me up to the house and up the stairs and onto my bed. Trying so hard not to wake me. I remember the sheets. Clean and cool. And when you and mommy kissed me goodnight. I was halfway between sleep and awake, like I am now. It was the best feeling. Best feeling in the whole world. But this is different, isn't it, Daddy? I'm dead. <laughs> Love you, Daddy. I love you wherever I go. Oh, Nick. I love you, Nick. I can't let you go. Let me go.